Hello everyone, um, welcome to Slime Rancher, uh, a game which is in beta, um, it's open to the public, you can buy it on Steam, and um, you can go and help out with the game's development and everything. Um, right now on this update, which is uh, V0.3.0C, is the Indigo Quarry update. And um, I got this game about a week ago, and it is fantastic. It is phenomenal. Amazing. Um, <laughs> so, let's start up a new game. Let's uh, select this tabby slime. This, this is a tabby slime. Uh, there are two modes. The adventure mode, which is kind of the default mode. And the five day rush. Only five days to play, and then you have to collect as much money as you can on that. I don't feel like doing that. I want to be able to have a little series going on. Uh, we're going to call this game... Just an RPG's world. Because it's my world. No one else's is mine. It's only mine. And let's go. So we're loading up the game. So when I first spawn, I'm going to be... Uh, on my ranch uh, this is my ranch so let's collect some stuff up um, this this is a pink slime pink slimes eat everything and um, in this game it's set up so that slimes tend to have a favorite food um, the one th the thing is pink slimes don't have a favorite food because if I go over here and I show you this is the uh, the plort market plorts are a slime's poop basically i don't know how they poop they don't hey no you're not going not going for this um i don't really know how a slime poops but basically uh you can see up there um pink plort is at 13 um it's going up right now um so like, I could go running around grabbing pink plur, but I don't feel like farming uh, pink slimes. Um, there are a bunch of different types of plort. Um, this large, large number right there, that is um, gold plort. Uh, you can only obtain it through a gold slime, and a gold slime cannot be captured. Uh, you kind of have to throw a plort or food at it, and... Uh, <laughs> I think of it as you just you throw food or something at it and it <laughs> shits out a plort or something real quick at you and tries to run away. So I'm gonna run over here and I'm gonna grab all of this food because I need all of it. All of it. All of it. <coughs> all of it. Sorry about, um, the coughing, I have a little bit of a cold. Um, it's not affecting me too much, but it is there. So, as you can see, this game looks very friendly. There are two crates right here. That's very nice. Ooh, a, roar, a stony head. You just ate the, the carrot. How, how dare you? Um, stony hen. Uh, stony hen is a tabby slime's favorite food and tabby slime. Oh, there's a large one over there. <laughs> oh Lucky uh, speak of the devil uh, you get over here. No eat it. Yeah Can I get him dead? Eat it. Yes more money <laughs> Oh yes, no bad bad pink slime that was a lucky slime um i've tried to record this twice and i got another lucky slime uh but i didn't have any chickens on me in order to get uh money from a lucky slime yeah i have to feed it a chicken and uh, at the time i didn't have chickens but now i do have chickens except now i don't have my stony hen but i actually got a lot more money from giving that stony hen to that lucky slime than i would normal slimes or um then i would oh hello uh then i would uh giving it just a hen hen so 
Yeah, in a way, it's kind of worth it. So, what I just got was a tabby slime. Uh, tabby slimes are uh, one of my favorite slimes, other than the rad slime. Because um, it's a cat. And who doesn't like cats? Like, what about the funny cats and everything? Okay, there, there is a chicken here. I want this chicken. See, these guys are all like, oh, give me this chicken. Give it. Give me that chicken. Oh. Give me that. <laughs> um. <clears throat> so what I'm doing right now is I'm collecting up food. Because that guy over there, he's going to want to eat all of it. Um. When I. Because as I feed him, he'll start to get bigger and bigger and bigger. Um. He's a pink slime gordo. See? Here. He's a pink slime gordo. So let's start feeding him. As I feed him, he's gonna get bigger and bigger and bigger. And eventually he's gonna start to jiggle. And uh, when he starts to jiggle, uh, he, it means he's about to pop. See? He be jiggling. So there's some more food right here. Let's just grab this up. Uh, he may be about to pop. Maybe. Oh, no. Um, I don't know where there's. Oh, wait. Oh, there's a crate. Food. Yes. Okay. Eat it. Eat it. <laughs> it's not enough. <laughs> He's still hungry. Uh, there's some more food up there. Up here. Yeah, but it never. It's, there's never anything there. Like, what the hell? Um. Alright, so let's move on. I can just go back and grab some more fruit from... Oh, hello. I'm gonna open you up here. That way if there's food and I don't want it... I don't want that. Uh, tabby slimes eat meat, so I'm gonna need that chicken. Um, in this game, quite a few slimes can actually hurt you. Uh, the rock slime can hurt you. Oh, well, that's a rock uh, largo. Uh, well, pink rock Largo. Uh, Largo's form when... Okay, so if I threw that down this pink... Or um, this tabby slime uh, in here, he could end up eating a plort. So he could end up eating a pink plort or rock plort. If he ate one of those plorts, he would then either turn into a pink tabby or a rock tabby. And um, Largo's are good if you want to farm. Uh, they allow basically pink pink um largos are kind of good if you want to have your largo eat everything but um more advanced largos are let are basically honey um honey rads largos um because rad here i'll show you rad plorts sell for a fair amount see they sell for 42 and then honey sells for 57 so that's that's good um a largo will if you basically if when i create the largo uh from rad and honey it it will have two favorite food being the rad slime's favorite food and the honey slime's favorite food which is pretty good because you got optional food to give it um i'm gonna put this tabby slime in here i'm gonna feed him and we're just gonna throw that chicken in his face. I'm gonna grab these guys. Um, I'm not gonna bother farming hen hens because hen hens are not extremely useful to me. Uh, nothing, nothing has a favorite hen hen. Nothing really likes the hen hen. Uh, same with uh, the pro pogo fruit. Same thing. That nothing really has a favorite of it. The only favorite food is not. Um, isn't any pogo fruit, but it is, um, any advanced kind of food. So not a carrot, not a pogo fruit, but other stuff like, uh, a heartbeat, which I did have, but I fed to this guy because I have to feed him. Pop. Now. Yes. And... He when they pop, basically they form a bunch of these guys. I just got a slime key that will allow me to open up an area. No, you ate it. Oh, all right, well, whatever. All right, let's get rid of these guys because we don't need them. And we don't need them on this island because there's not a food, enough food uh, to be made on this island for them. 
all right so there we go we just got some money from that and um, now we have a slime key now this slime key will allow me to open up one of two areas um, first one is the indigo quarry uh, the other one is um, kind of a forest jungle uh, you know what I'm gonna grab this these plort because I can sell it and when I sell it I can go and get money from them I can get money from everything and anything oh yes, yes. oh hello you know it's actually more worth just grabbing the, the rock slime than anything because then that way I can uh, it's more of a long-term thing you, you always want to think of the long-term stuff not the short term um, it's always good to grab plorts as you run back and forth from home and back but sometimes it's more worth just grabbing a slime or two um, I know quite a few people who go and farm pink slimes but they're more it really there's no need to farm them they're everywhere it, like in this first area they are everywhere so really if you want to farm pink slimes go ahead but I recommend just leaving pink slimes don't bother farming them they are the one slime you don't need to farm because there's a large amount of them and I'm gonna sneeze for a moment pardon me Oh, pardon me. I have a cold, so uh, that kind of thing is going to happen to me. So let's drop these guys off. Now, something that could happen is if these guys stack on top of one another and go over this fence and, I don't know, somehow eat a plort from this tabby slime and this tabby slime jumps over and gets into this pen, uh, they could end up creating a Largo. Oh, hello. I don't want you hurting me. Um... But when they create a Largo, then... Um, I can't suck them up. Oh, find me. Mm. I can't suck them up in my backpack, so I can't put the, a Largo in my inventory. It's just gonna be on my screen as I try to suck it. From there, I can just go and launch it, but... By that point in time, it's like... I'm just gonna ha farm these guys for now, because I can at least put them in my inventory. And, um... Yeah, yeah. Okay, so something I'm going to definitely do is get the jetpack upgrade. Cause this will allow me to fly. Not for very long, but long enough. Um, and uh, there's not much I can really do in the sense of um, anything, really. Um, Something I'm going to need to do is I'm going to run out here real quick. Um, because I have the jetpack, it's easier for me to go and uh, get a specific type of vegetable. And uh, it's the rock slime's favorite. Because they eat vegetables. It's the heartbeat. Uh, heartbeat is something I gave that pink lar uh, or um, that pink giant slime, fat slime uh, earlier. But... Um, I needed I kind of needed to pop them to get the slime key so I can get into a better area to get better slime and uh, if you want I recommend right on the first day always always try to get a slime key because it's always good to try to get the good slimes right off the bat so you can make some nice money right away so I'm just gonna sit here let my jetpack uh, well not my jetpack but my energy refill and uh, we're gonna continue moving on up we go all right so now we just got to go back home so with these heartbeats uh, I'm going to plant one of them and create a crop from them and um, the rest I'm just gonna give to the rock slime uh, that way they can give me some more plort oh my god I'm tired today aren't I um oh hello fast fast slime actually I'm gonna oh Oh, okay, well, whatever. Here, let's just grab, do that so I can get something up. So a Largo. A Largo slime is a hybrid. Uh, hybrids are can be found when a normal slime eats a plort unlike its own. Um, another thing that can be created from a Largo. So let's say I mix a honey slime with a rad slime. If those two slimes were made and then I gave it, 
that um, Largo Atabi plort, it would end up becoming a rainbow pile of goop. Um, <laughs> basically, this goop goes and tries to eat everything. Like they they are like the destroyer worlds. They kill, they kill all the slime. They they try to kill everything. Uh, not really kill it, but they they're like very annoying. Oh oh, you um gonna throw that over there. I'm gonna throw you in there. I'm gonna grab this heartbeat back because I need it. Um, but they can end up being formed on your ranch too, uh, which is why you need these corrals. That way you don't have, if you have a lot of s different types of slime, they don't end up becoming something that tries to eat all the slime and uh, ruin your day. So right now I can create a, a, f a crop or a garden, uh, still a crop. And I'm gonna put this in there. So this is how much time until the crop uh, kind of dissipates. So I can farm it about three days. So what to do? What to do? Not much to do. Um, other than let's go to the indigo quarry. But I'm gonna sleep on it first. So let's sleep. So when you first go into your uh, little home the, for the first time, you'll see, uh, I don't know if this is a pillow or not, but this is a little pink slime over here. Uh, we got the star rail. Welcome to Far Far Rage. Oh, oh. Uh, the uh, corporation would like to welcome me uh, to the Far Far Range, um, which is very far away from Earth. And Plort, it, they're hoping I will supply them with Plorts in which... I, they will use the plort. So for example, um, radiation, um, a nuclear power plant, you need uranium to create power from a nuclear power plant. So in order to do that, you need uranium. And then from there it goes, kind of creates radioactive material and whatnot and power. Plort, radi um, rad slime plorts, are basically kind of like uranium um, same with like rock slime uh, I don't know why rock like some slimes are strange in the sense of like how do you use it but for example um, the honey slime kind of obvious it's honey uh, that's what the plort is it's basically pure honey uh, same with um, the rad slime pure uranium basically um, gold slime, same thing, pure gold. Um, some other plorts, I, I don't know, but who knows? Oh, I didn't sleep. That is something I should do. Uh, sleeping until morning could be your friend. Uh, if you want to do quick farming, uh, it will definitely make your guys upset because you wouldn't have fed them in that time. But for right now I kind of want to just get farming going and in order to do that I gotta go sleep the one day and farm the next so um, I think I'm gonna be ending this episode soon in a moment uh, I'm gonna end it when I go into the indigo quarry oh this guy's very hungry aren't you you're hungry you're hungry you're still hungry Ooh. Oh, you're still hungry. Oh, you still hungry? Oh, you're still hungry. You still hungry? No, you're not. Okay, good. Well, this is a lot of plort. See, this is another good thing. If you don't feed your, um, if you just sleep and don't feed your slime for about a day or two, they will give you so many plort because they'll be like super upset, but they'll eat a lot. So that's something you kind of want sometimes. So I'm going to try to get as much plort as I can and not get hit by the these those slime this slime he doesn't hurt me oh he traps me um <laughs> the, the tabby slime like to jump at you and they'll also grab some like they'll put things in their mouth so these chickens this slime could this uh, tabby slime could put them in their in its mouth and uh yeah he likes to jump Oh, I think he wants... Here, 
What? Ow. Don't. There we go. <laughs> if you want to, like, if they're right by the wall, just try to suck them up on the inside of the wall. Um. Alright. Alright, so let's go to the Indigo Quarry, because uh, time is time is of the essence. Uh, we're on day two. We want to go into the Indigo Quarry today. So. We got a crate. Let's open it up. Ooh, rock slime. Or, uh, hen, uh stony hen. Uh, stony hen. Very good hen hen. Uh, it's not a hen hen, but it's a, a stony hen. And uh, they are the tabby slime's favorite food. So I'm going to go and set up a coop. And I'm going to put... So now, stony hens are going to start being made. Um, through the little po process of, uh, of life. Like it is on Earth. Those chickens are going to do what they, what they would on Earth. Slimes don't reproduce. They kind of just spawn. Uh oh. Uh, I'm going to get rid of you. Oh. Okay. I thought another one was created. Um, I don't want Largos in this area. Um, especially Rock Largos. Because they can get very annoying. And um, the amount of pink and phosphorus slimes kind of spawn in this area. It's, it's not good. Uh, this area is another area. Oh, look at that. Come down. Come down, come to me, come to me, come to me, there we go, very good. Alright, so I'm gonna hang on to these guys, these guys are gonna travel with me into the indigo quarry. Uh, from there I can go and find a, an, abundant, an abundance of uh, rock slime, um, boom slime, what are, you, what are you doing in here, here. I'll help you. Get out. You. Go get go get food. You're hungry, aren't you? So, when I get come in here, um these guys are going to spawn. <laughs> these guys are going to spawn. And uh if I feed them, this guy isn't going to be angry with me, but I think he's still going to hurt me, isn't he? So, he's going to keep jumping at me. I'll feed Oh, oh. See, he's angry. Uh, when they're angry, they they kind of like just want to hurt you. So if I go up to this guy, are you gonna hurt me? No, you're not. Except you all are going to die. So I'd recommend you get in here. Um, phosphor slimes can't survive out in uh, the sunny area. They can only survive in dark areas. So dark areas such as this. Ooh. Eat. Okay, so I'm gonna throw all these guys in here. All of them are gonna just chill out in here. I don't know if they can, they'll hurt me. No, they're they're all kind of just acting as if they were. Um, they're all acting as if they were uh, angry. It, it's a weird glitch in the game, a, a little bug. Um, I. I hope it does get fixed eventually, where when you do feed these slimes, the angry ones, they aren't angry with you anymore, and they kind of act like a default slime, like a Largo slime. Um, you don't, you will, you will never see a, a normal tiny slime, like, you would never see a type of, like a guy like that, just all angry trying to bite at you and all that. It's only Largos. Alright. Into the indigo quarry we go with the slime key. So now I no longer have my slime key. I'm gonna give. Yeah, you hear a bunch of. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> See, an abundance, an abundance of. Uh... Oh no, there's the first tar. I gotta get rid of him. Oh, he's gonna spawn another one, isn't he? Oh no, he didn't. Okay, so a tar, an awful rainbow, an awful rainbow basically thing. Um. A rainbow that is very deadly. Um, oh wow, he smashed that thing open. Well, I'm just gonna not take any of this because I don't really need it. Um, tar are definitely a problem, especially in these this area, and um, the f 
the jungle area because there's so many different types of slime and um with a largo so this pink rock largo if he he ate ta a tabby a plort or a boom plort he would turn into a tar and tars eat everything they eat slimes they eat largos they eat ranchers that's a problem so that's two things so far that want to hurt me uh, these guys can hurt me too so if i go up to him he'll hurt me um but it's only because they're they, like they got spikes Ooh. Uh, they got spikes and those spikes can hurt me so i'm gonna go up here for a second uh those spikes can hurt me and i don't want to be hurt by them um this episode's been fairly long already as much as it is uh, I got a bunch of little friends here who are crowding around me um, uh, I think the next episode I will do um, maybe a second by now maybe not maybe I'll do do it at my ranch I don't know I think I'll do it in a moment but um, other than that it doesn't matter. What matters is a beautiful sight, which are all these slimes and largos all living together in harmony. It's, uh, it looks very nice, doesn't it? Well, I guess this is goodbye. Goodbye, everyone.